Well, French President Emmanuel Macron has condemned as inexcusable the brutal repression of Algerian protesters by Paris police on 60 years ago. On October 17, 1961, officers carried out a deadly crackdown on a demonstration by tens of thousands of Algerians in one of the darkest episodes in post-war France. Some historians say more than 200 people were killed in the violence. It's the first time a French president has attended a memorial ceremony for the Algerians killed on that night. Emmanuel Macron joined relatives of the victims in paying tribute. 60 years ago, at this spot, bodies were fished out from the Seine River. An estimated 25,000 Algerians rallied peacefully in protest against a curfew imposed on them alone. Police responded without mercy, arresting nearly 12,000 and killing dozens, throwing their bodies into the river. Many others were taken away to sorting centres and then deported. Said Abtou was there that night. The police came. When they got to us, they started to massacre people, hitting them with batons on the head, then kicking them in the head with their shoes. I'd never seen anything like that. The violence occurred in the final year of France's violent attempt to keep Algeria as one of its colonies. For decades, successive administrations ignored the massacre. President Macron's condemnation of the killings was only issued in a written statement and did not include an apology. This year's commemoration took place amid diplomatic tensions between both countries over their history.